So, uh, just launched my YouTube channel. If you haven't seen it, guys, Neil Pick Up Supernatural Strength Channel. Check it out. And uh, we're getting some content together over the next few days. Not sure what we're going to be doing yet, but um, started off with a video where uh, I, I, I arm wrestled and, well, taught some arm wrestling technique and arm wrestled with uh, former world's strongest man and uh, old time deadlift record holder, Eddie the Beast Hall. Good mate of mine. He's coming into the World Arm Wrestling League at uh, WL601. Going to be an exciting matchup, can't wait. He's got massive potential. Rob, Vigil Jr., you little bitch. I'm coming for you. There it is, yes! It'll be interesting to see uh, how Eddie can do, and particularly if he's interested to stay with the sport, where he can get to. It's all right. I'm wrestling Eddie O, but he can't move that well. What do you mean? He, he, because yeah. of his size, you mean? Okay. So what, you think smaller people are a bit tougher in some ways? Yes, that's what I mean. Like who, exactly? Well, I'm wrestling plenty of small guys, like, like, like who? Like me. I get what you're saying, right? You, you obviously rate yourself as a bit of an arm wrestler. Fair enough. But you, you are also a midget. And, um, you know, an arm wrestling table's built to suit a man six feet in height. You can't actually reach the arm wrestling table at all without having a seat, a box, something to get you up to the height of the table. And even then, you're reaching right over it. So, all due respect, mate, you're not going to be quite as big a threat just yet as Eddie Hall. But if I had a table about my size, I would kick some ass. We've made like a 20 minute detour, and we're now on our way to B&Q. Uh, because my midget here has made a claim that he can beat me if he had a table that fits him. Is that right, son? Is that what I'm hearing? Yes, okay. that is what you're hearing. That is what I'm hearing. Well, I'm glad you like your chances, mate. We're gonna get yourself, get you to, we're gonna get to B&Q. We're on our way to B&Q, we're gonna get to B&Q. We're gonna buy some materials to make this table for you. A midget sized arm wrestling table, little tiny arm wrestling table, and once we've got it, mate, you need to back up all of this meth. I hope you've got your technique dialed in, son, because you're dealing with the fat lad. It's on. Because if I get a table my size, I am gonna kick your ass, mate. <laughs> Alright, dude. We'll see then. We will I don't know, see. Things I get talked into. I'm now coming spending money. I'm here at B&Q. I'm going to build this lad an arm wrestling table and see if he can back up his. So you better be able to back it up. You little. From metal or wood here, Dad. Probably, probably wood, mate. To be honest. Wood's down here. Then. All right. So we've got our stuff. We've been to B&Q. Bought some wood. We've got a top. We don't really know dimensions, but we're going to take a flying guess at it. We've just done a couple of little uh, measurements. We're going to be uh, going with about 34 to 35 uh, inches high. I'm going to go with 34, I think, and uh, it can take a wider stance if it needs to. Uh, let's get it on! Hopefully it's the right size for you, brother. I ring it will be. Getting ready for the arm wrestling tape. More going. You can see the black line that he's got. Really sharp saw. And he strikes through it. Starting to take shape, mother fluffers. Starting to take shape. I think you'll find we have ourselves a base. Just so you can see what I used, it's just basic 3v2 and a uh, little bit of sort of three or four milli ply here. Keeps it nice and light for lads to move As about. wind sweeps in, pass back in my truck. I've only finished top. As that can see behind me, as my hand shakes like shitting dog, I've finished basic frame outline. So you can see frame behind me here, uh, basically just made out of 3B2. Uh, I've done another little piece on it here because that last one, my hand was shaking so badly like something out of the Blair Witch Project. 
Well, they got about 100 subscribers, and about 99 of them are puked. As you can see, the frame's starting to take shape behind me. Uh, I'm starting to take shape in front of it. Stamps this week's shape, a sack of spuds. Um, for anybody out there who's thinking that I've got like building skills, uh, that is not true. I'm definitely more Bobbins the Builder than Bob the Builder. But it's a kid's arm wrestling table. It's taken it me about two hours. Um, lads are going to have a lot of fun. Biggity, biggity, bong. So there it is, guys. That's the basic outline of the see, table. It's only little. It stands about 34 inches high, something like that, which should be okay for my uh, for my lads. about 18 inches across. Um, yeah. Just Just little get table. Now and see if my little dude can back up his mouth. I'm going to try and stick a, a little bit of paint on it. Just fire some black paint on it. We'll get some pads on it. And uh, let's get them arm wrestling. What grabs your eyes on that, if anything? 